If you do this, you'll have to check the timing once you pull the cast off, but you can get really, really, really close by marking your bolts in the mounting point, because these bolts are meant to slide left and right. So just make sure you get a rough estimate. I try and hide the color um, until they're on, but it might be difficult. But to reinstall the baffling onto the RB26 valve covers or inside the valve covers, you need some red RTV silicone. So just went to O'Reilly's and got that and some blue thread lock. The blue thread lock is for the tiny bolts that go in here. And what we're going to do, or what you do, you just take a proudly sponsored by Miller Lite and Insane Imports. Also the Kirby's who did the powder coat. But what you do is you just go in and you make a thin tiny layer. You can kind of see the color. Ignore that. Uh, don't ignore it. It looks sick. But you do that. Make sure that your sponges are in. And then what you do... Is remember how these go and they do go like that right uh oh yeah well I can't you want to clean the grime off this too give me one second I need to reposition this so you want to put them down in like this uh, and what that does is whenever oil drips down into these little collections it drips back out through there and you want those down like that so when the engine is when the covers are right 
it's sitting like this and it's dripping back down into the engine bay or phallic like cam covers essentially so we are going to put these to back in without damaging anything hopefully I'm just gonna gently press that down And then we'll take some blue Loctite onto the bolts. And just... Hand tighten them in. I'm gonna do that now. And that is how. Ooh, ooh, that is how you uh, install the baffles. So uh, couldn't really find anything online about it, uh, other than the Tomei ones, which eventually I'll probably get. I don't think HKS sells one. Sells one. Uh, so yeah. Now we need to put the cover gaskets on. On the front timing cover, you have to do the same thing with the RTV. You have to go all the way around it. And then there's also the little inlet hole that you have to do. Um, it's like where one of these bolts go through, you have to do the outside of it. So whenever you press it in, it just gives the cushion. And then that's upstairs drying. So now we have to clean the surface of the head, which... This side's already clean, and we have to put the right, no, I guess that'd be the left side, cut rocker arm cover back on, and then we gotta do the right side, which is right there. Um, yeah, so let's get to it. Uh, one valve covers on, uh, be the passenger side, and then for hardware, we are going with Z1, just regular hardware set, um, Z-Spec 06704, and we're just going with a simple black look, um, to keep it clean with the, uh, I'm sure you know color now, so let's get to bolting this one side down, and we'll go from there. What I was talking about earlier, 
that you can see is you need to make a little gasket the way all the way around and then this little bolt and that just keeps it from bouncing off of the cover. Uh -huh.